Hello everyone, it's your girl Tasha and I'm back to you guys with another video. So as you guys can see by the title today, we're going to be doing my pamper slash self-care routine, which is going to include a shower and some after self-care work. Okay, let's get started. So today we're going to start off by putting on a face mask. I always do this and my face mask of choice today is the Caudalie Renergetic C Plus Mask. And I feel like this is a really good mask to awaken your skin and to just overall improve your mood. While I let my face mask dry, I am just setting up my blanket and I'm using a heated blanket today and I also like using this when I'm on my cycle. Um, this heated blanket has settings where you can set it to whatever temperature you want and how many hours you want it to stay warm. I feel like when you are just in a mood where you need comfort or you want to relax or it's a cold day or if you're on your menstrual, it can really bring you a lot of comfort and that is just what I like to do. Now that I've done that, I'm going ahead and I'm putting my towel in the towel warmer because I need a warm towel. And if you don't have a towel warmer, girl, you're just not grown. And that's it. That is all. All right. So let's head into the kitchen. And before that, I'm going to put my robe down. Now that we're in the kitchen, I am putting together my flower arrangement. And I'm calling it an arrangement because I'm arranging the flowers. Duh. And I'm just going to pour my water in. I'm going to let you guys watch me assemble my flowers. As you guys can see, I am cutting my flowers at an angle and I learned this on TikTok. TikTok is like the best place to learn things. It's so practical. And so yes, that is what I am doing. I like to get myself flowers like every single week and sometimes they last longer. I guess it's just depending on where I put them in my house. I typically like to put them on my nightstand in my bedroom or sometimes I'll leave them in the kitchen but I try not to do that just because my son is allergic to pollen and I feel like it'll bother him a bit. But if you don't have a significant other and you are in the streets, not literally, but if you are single and you just don't have someone to buy you flowers, buy them for yourself. They'll make you happy if you like flowers. If you don't, find something else. This is just something that I like to do to make myself feel good. Now that we have our flower arrangement set together, I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to take them to my room. Okay, so let's get into the shower. So I'm letting my body get wet. I'm just relaxing. You guys see that eucalyptus? I know you see it. So I'm using a silicone sponge that I got from Target and an ivory bar soap. I like to cleanse with soap, with a bar soap first as always. Um, and I really like a silicone sponge just because I feel like it's very sanitary. I feel like it's very practical if you are on your cycle or if you just want something that's going to be like clean for the most part and you don't have to worry about it like holding on to odors. It's really practical to clean after you've already taken a shower and I just love it. As you guys can see, there's no issue with setting up. As long as you are underwater and you're using soap and the bar soap is wet, there should be no reason why you can't use it. I personally like it because it's a double exfoliant. So yes. Moving on, we're going to use my always cleanser. I love this stuff and I do wash my intimate areas with my hands because I feel like it just gives me a better clean. I can feel with my fingers and yeah. Now we're moving on to my Dove exfoliant body polish and I love this stuff guys. It's like a body conditioner and an exfoliant all in one and as you guys know um, I like to exfoliate multiple times a week just because I feel like my skin looks better it glows better and also because you know I've told you guys many times I have strawberry legs and I want to um, just eliminate the appearance of dark marks and I want a better and closer shave now we're gonna move on to body wash and this is my Dove body wash it doesn't really have a scent um, it has hyaluronic acid in it and I feel like it makes my skin look so, so glowy. I feel like when you're pampering yourself, you have to use products that work together for your skin and not just depend on one product to like, you know, take care of your skin. 
make your products work for you. So now that we're out the shower, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start off by putting on coconut oil on my skin. Um, and typically I would do this while my skin is still wet, but because I'm doing this video and you guys don't know me like that, so I'm not gonna do that and it's inappropriate, okay? So yes, we're putting coconut oil on and then we're gonna go in with my, the Rose Moroccan Scented um, Whipped Butter by Tree Hut and we're just gonna rub that all over our body. And I feel like when you pair an oil and um, cream together, it really just makes your body look so much more glowy. When I moisturize my hair, I use the lock method, which is basically liquid, oil, and cream. And I like to use the same type of method for my skin lock method so it's loc and that's liquid oil and cream now as you guys can see the oil and the lotion just pair so great together it makes my legs so shiny it just is making me feel good look at me feeling myself it's giving so now i'm moving on to the last part which is my perfume i love to smell good as you guys know and now we're going to move into the next step which is my self-care box I did this in one of my last videos and today we're doing a journal prompt on what has God shown me recently and I'm also going to be wearing some foot peeling socks and at the moment I wasn't I, I wasn't really aware that these socks would make my feet peel I just wasn't paying attention I just thought they were a foot mask which is what I usually get just to um, help take care of my feet in between pedicures but nevertheless we're gonna go ahead and journal while these stay on my feet and when I put these on my feet y'all my feet was feeling so soft after so I'm not gonna lie a few days later it definitely threw me off that my feet were peeling but anywho so I did journal about what God has shown me recently and recently I just feel like God has been showing me a lot of um, grace and he's been giving me like convictions which is why i really know that like certain things that i'm learning about in church um are helping you know what i mean and yes yeah, so you should journal and if you don't do self-care make sure that you just implement some time in your schedule to do so you've heard it here first and if you guys enjoyed this video i would love if you subscribe like and comment and i'll see you guys in my next one bye Mwah.